So we're in our hotel in Davao, Philippines. And uh, as usual, we're, we try to stay around $20 a night. There it is. Come in. <laughs> Come in. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> That's Boy. Hobo Ventures. Oof, what are you doing in the Philippines? Wow, man. <laughs> I don't know. You don't know? I don't know. Okay. Very nice room. You like? It's but okay it's, for 20 it's, bucks, huh? Yeah, it's, uh, it's compared with what we have in Penang. Oh, yeah. It's five and more, it's, a lot it's more space. More space. Yeah. I don't work good. It's clean. Got a Great TV, thing. little tiny desk. Have, uh, yeah. the window also. Window also. So there's the window. Yeah. So we're in the like the city area of Dava. We didn't get enough time to decide where to stay, so we thought we'd stay right in the city. It's one of the better ranked retirement cities or uh, to live in the Philippines. So we'll see. You'll you'll see with us. We're discovering it together. Neither one of us has been here yet. We've both been to the Philippines before, but even before we met, um, I'd been to Boracay and um, Manila and Cebu. And Cebu and Boho. Yeah. And these very right clean that compared with my last visit. Yeah. They say, but what I'm seeing from the airport to here, the street is so clean. Compared to Cebu? Yeah. yeah. I was busy on my laptop trying to. Make sure the world didn't end while we were flying. It didn't end. Yeah. Anyway, so let's see. Yay, the pose. Oh, <laughs> stretch. Yeah, it's so tiring, <laughs> man. Too much flying? Wasn't too bad. Right. No, it was, I was busy at home for... Oh, yeah. She was working all day with her mom. She would get up in the morning and like clean house, cook. Well, My video would be up soon. Oh, there we go. Hobo okay. Ventures, YouTube Hobo Ventures. It's, you can visit her webpage below. Just click below and you'll see her Instagram page, her uh, webpage, her YouTube page. Good, so you're going to share your family life? Sure. All right. See you. See you. Chung Hoi is filming her her breakfast. It's uh, we're at McDonald's in Davao, Philippines. It's, it's a dollar fifty each. Uh, includes coffee, hash browns, and an egg McMuffin. <laughs> we found a store with everything in it, like shoes, toiletries, um, household cooking, and it's all super cheap. There's links to everything we discuss in this video. No need to take notes. Just click the more information link in the notes below this video to get links to everything on Google Maps. Chung Hoi's lunch is $1.60. We're in the food court on the fourth floor of G Mall. There's a million places, but she's eating at Pizzeo's Grill. Cucumber and okay. egg. This coconut vinegar. I have to make by myself. Yeah, she's, it's kind of like a ceviche. This is a raw tuna and onion and more cucumber and lots of coconut vinegar she's squirting on there. The ceviche, from what I remember, is more like lemon and lime. But. The yellow thing is ginger. Mm. 
So the squid was 150 and the other stuff was 90. The other two plates. Yeah. And so, and you have half of it left. You couldn't yeah. even eat it all. Because I have a vegetarian pasta. Yeah. The poor thing. Yeah. When did that happen? That's just I have my half taken away. Yeah, the poor thing. So, you, um, so, so uh, it's really 250 for me. And you're talking squid. Uh, it's different taste of the these ones. I still prefer ceviche. I best. I love uh, lemon to cook the. I mean, like Peruvian ceviche. Yeah, Peruvian ceviche. Yeah. This does remind me of South America. Though. Oh yeah, it's like I think it's like Guayaquil. Yeah. Puerto in Guayaquil, the flat, the building is all one level. Yeah. And it's like almost like empty and falling down, but the <laughs> the street is, is clean. The street is clean. The street's clean, but a lot of holes in it. <laughs> yeah, and it seems like nice people. So. Oh, that one is famous of uh, tuna. Tuna, yeah. yeah. That's the original uh, industry here. For tuna. So this is the grounds for Huckleberry Kitchen and Bar. It's, a, um, it's an old uh, house. It's been converted into a bunch of little businesses. There's a, a little coffee shop here. Um, and then there's um, retail and a restaurant. And looks looks expensive, but we read online that beers are two dollars. So we thought we'd just come have one beer. It's right here. Yeah, it's looking a little boring, honestly. You can go find a regular bar if you want. Can you go inside? Yeah. Hey babe, what is that? Kentucky fried cup of cauliflower, it's very nice. It's very, very nice. With sauce and without sauce, it works good. <laughs> The bean with the rice and flavor. It's spicy, it's good. We're at the vegan dinosaur in Davao, Philippines. You look very tired, huh? I'm tired, yeah. Long day at the beach. This is Chung Hoi's walnut meatball at the vegan dinosaur. And this is my Buddha bowl. Mm, yummy! Okay, after we eat, we'll let you know how it goes. We're at the Mandarin Tea Garden in uh, Davao City for lunch. And we ordered our lunch, and Chen Hui ordered a dessert at the same time as we ordered lunch. You don't want to eat, I eat for you first. Okay. Normally, when you order your dessert with your food, you would get the dessert after you've eaten, but they brought it right away. So <laughs> we got our dessert before we had our lunch. How is it? Oh, it's good. Yeah. Hello, hello, hello. You love it. Well, you hello to you. Do yeah. you, you love hello to everyone or just... You will love it. I will love it, okay. So try this one. What do you think? I think there's a lot of flavors there all at once. Yeah. So good. It's a very nice dinner. Mm. A lot going on. Mm. 
It's more nicer than the Malaysia dessert. They don't have this so much flavor. It reminds me of that dessert you had in Hanoi with all the stuff mixed in. Oh, but this one's better. Combined with dessert in Vietnam, um, Vietnam, Malaysia, they have this icing dessert. They put on everything on the top. Plus it has like a, doesn't it have weed in it or something? Like some kind of cracker? Yeah. So, Philippine wine is the best. Mm. Some voice grooving on the Philippines. I really like that island we went to yesterday. You guys will see film of it soon. Mm. It's good. Now that we've ruined our lunch. As long as we don't tell our moms, we'll be okay. Does your mom let you eat dessert before your meal? Mm -hmm. She does? My mom used to say, she would threaten us, if you don't finish your meal, you won't get dessert. But then she would feed us the dessert every time, so we knew we didn't have to. Mm. Oh, so good. Good, right? Nice. So here's our meals. So what do you think of our lunch? It's just like fast food lunch. <laughs> fast food lunch. It's just here. Yeah, it's right across from our hotel. You don't like fast food? Mm, no. It's, it's okay. We need to work, so. Yeah, mine was uh, $2. $2, yes. Yeah, and yours was three fifty, and the dessert was like a buck. Yeah. <laughs> Chenghui likes her chicken rice, two dollars and twenty-five cents. Chicken rice on the uh, uh, web page below. Just click below, and you can see the address of this place and the name under chicken rice. I have a feeling that's going to be the best meal that we'll eat. Uh, definitely in Davo, maybe even all of the Philippines. It was, oh, I loved it. I loved it. I told you already, it's, it's compared with a different kind. The, compared with Malaysia, Thailand, and Vietnam, the vegetarian food that we eat, they have a lot of fake meat. Yeah. But this one is all plants, uh, plants and uh, vegetable base. Yeah. So you eat those vegetables, is you will not see in the supermarket. Right, it was delicious. Just extraordinary. Yeah. Forgot to mention the mo most important part about that lunch. The price. We both ate there for $3.20. Huge plates of food. Delicious. Amazing. 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 So if you do the math on that, um, I usually have my protein shake um, in the mornings after my workout and um, that is probably a dollar is what it costs me. And Chung Hoi has uh, oatmeal in the morning, or no actually mine's probably 50 cents and hers is about 50 cents too, it's probably even less than that actually. But, and then if she has three meals a day of, uh, at that price and I have one, I usually have one meal plus my shake every day. Uh, we would be eating for less than eight dollars a day. If you're going to the resorts that we showed you in other videos, and you want to rent a tent, the beach resorts, they can get a tent for like two dollars a night in some of them. You can get it here in Unitop. They have tents in there. Well, I haven't priced them, but I noticed them in there. So tomorrow morning we catch the bus to CDO, the next city. So we're here to pick up some snacks for the bus, for the bus ride. An eight hour bus ride. Um, probably get some peanuts, maybe some fruit, whatever else Chen Hui wants. This is peeled papaya for 40 cents US.
Thanks for watching our video. Uh, we've written retired cheap reports all over the world. Please stop by vagabondbuddha.com, take a look at the reports we have and see if you would be interested in find, finding out how to live the international lifestyle for less than half of what you probably thought it would cost. This is Dan of Vagabond Buddha. Hey, if you're enjoying this video, could you please like it? subscribe or comment any of those would increase our rankings in the search engines which would help our business greatly thanks so much in advance